Peacock Ridge Farm. I am so glad that you're here today. I always enjoy our time together. I am going to share with you one of my very favorite appetizer recipes. It's stuffed mushrooms. The recipe is so simple and delicious. It's perfect whether you're entertaining your friends and family or if it's just for a casual night at home. Come on, I'll show you. I am going to make a gluten-free, dairy-free version of this recipe, but I'm also going to show you how you can make it if you are not gluten-free and dairy-free. So I have white mushrooms, I have sausage, I'm using coconut milk. What I love about this brand is the cream of the coconut milk is separated from the other liquid. I'm going to use only the cream for this recipe. And I'm going to use pork rinds today. If you are not gluten-free, you can use either panko or breadcrumbs. Again, I'm going to use pork rinds. I'm going to preheat my oven at 375 degrees. The next thing that I'm going to do is just simply break off the stems, set them aside, and I'm going to lay my mushroom caps facing down. I'm going to bake these mushroom caps for about 15 minutes. And all this is going to do is remove some of the water that is naturally in the mushrooms so that the mushrooms are a little more meatier and uh, not so uh, heavy with the liquid. Now that I have all of my stems off, I'm just going to pop the caps into the oven for about 10 minutes. While the mushroom caps are in the oven, I'm going to go ahead and chop up the stems. You want to chop the stems up quite finely as they are going to be part of the stuffing. And now I'm just going to crumble some of the pork rinds. I'm going to use my food processor. If you don't have one, go ahead, put your pork rinds in a Ziploc baggie and use a rolling pin to crumble them. It works just as well. And now I'll just add these crumbs to my bowl as well. And now I'm going to add my coconut cream. It's uh, nice and thick. If you're uh, not doing dairy free, feel free to use cream cheese. And now I'm just adding my sausage. And a bit of salt and pepper. I'm pulling out my mushroom caps. I don't want them to overcook. And now I just mix it all together with my hands. Now I'm just gonna turn my caps over and fill them with the filling. If you are not doing the dairy-free, it tastes wonderful by adding just a little bit of Parmesan cheese to this recipe as well. And now just fill all of the caps full of the stuffing. After I filled the mushrooms with the sausage stuffing, I put them in the oven and I bake them at 350 degrees for 20 to 25 minutes. And that's it. These stuffed mushrooms are so easy and so delicious, and they are the perfect appetizer. Thank you so much for stopping by today. I always enjoy our time together. Please follow me on facebook.com slash Peacock Ridge Farm on Instagram at Peacock Ridge, on Pinterest, and YouTube. And most of all, follow me on my blog at PeacockRidgeFarm.com. Blessings to you.